The first stage in creating our series circuit is to solder tabbing wire, this stuff, onto the back of each cell. So we're only going to do one side of each cell to begin with. Now this cell has three lines on the front and it has equivalently on the back three lots of three lines that match up with the continuous lines on the front. These are basically just the same thing. This is the positive and that's the negative. What we're going to do is we're going to cut a piece of tabbing wire that's twice the length of the cell. So that's easy to do. I just get it, fold it over and then cut there like that. Now to save yourself time when you're actually building up the full panel it's good to cut one piece of the length you're going to need and then work out how many you're going to need so I would need three per cell and I've got eight cells so that's 24 so I would cut 24 pieces this long all at once so I'm all ready to go. So I've got my piece of tabbing wire and what I'm going to do is I'm now going to solder it onto the bottom. To solder we need to use our flux pen and our flux pen uh, contains very small amounts of solder um, which is going to melt when we apply the soldering iron to it and that's going to allow us to connect permanently the tabbing wire to the bottom of the cell. So you get your soldering pen, you can just give it a little press down to see that it's definitely not run out and then we're going to run that along each of these white sections on the bottom of the panel. After you've done that, and this will dry in about 20 seconds, so you don't need to rush, but don't take too long. We're going to take our tabbing wire and lay it out flat like this. We're going to take our soldering iron, which is already warm because I've left it plugged in for about 10 minutes, and really just like a pencil, we're going to put it down on there. We're going to give it a little bit of time because it's quite a cold day. And then we're just going to run it along like this. And you can see that it has now stuck that piece of tabbing wire down. I'm going to do that again along here. And then I'm going to do it along here as well. Now you can see here it hasn't stuck brilliantly. So I'm going to need to go and try and do that again. Let's see if that's worked. So at the end here, it's not sticking particularly well. That might be because the flux pen has dried up a little bit. So what I'll do now is go back, apply a bit more flux, get my soldering iron, push it down. I'm just going to hold it here make sure that it gets nice and hot I'm going to push it along and that's now stuck